Hello, welcome to Vedial Vagaparai. In this video, we are going to see a question uh, from CSIR Net June 2023 question paper. This question is based on BSAP theory and shapes of molecule. Let us see the question. It's a very simple question. A set of molecules are given SO4, ClO4 minus, FClO3, and IFO plus. These are the four molecules that are given. And the question is the number of species having seesaw shape yes so they are asking among these four how many of them are having a seesaw shape so there are four options that are given here so first let us see the question and the molecules so we know a seesaw looks like this so the molecular geometry will uh, be distorted to this particular shape that is what we are going to see So let us take all these four molecules. I have written the uh, shortcut method as to how to uh, calculate uh, the bond pairs and lone pairs. If you want to know a detailed explanation of how all these are done, please uh, look at my earlier videos which have a detailed explanation as to how to calculate these uh, bond pairs and lone pairs and how to connect between valence bond theory and BACPR theory. Here I will just um, give you a uh, total summary of this and then we will discuss the question at hand. So in FClO3 we see the total number of bond pairs is 4 and there is no lone pair and because this molecule has 4 bonds it is of the type AX4 and when the molecule is of the type AX4 without any lone pair of electron then the geometry will be tetrahedral and the shape of the molecule also will be tetrahedral. So here in this case, we see the molecule has a tetrahedral geometry like this. So this is pointed from top. So that is how we see. And here, as we all know, chlorine is, the, is more electropositive than oxygen and fluorine. And so this chlorine is the central atom. So if there is a question on which is the central atom. Then you must remember among the three, chlorine is the central atom because it is the electropositive. That is the reason why in some problems, you will see ClFO3 will be given. So that is also a correct way of representing the molecule. And uh, coming to the next, ClO4 minus. Again, here we see there is only four bond pairs, no lone pairs. So this molecule is also of the type AX4 without any lone pair of electrons. So the geometry will be tetrahedral and the shape of the molecule will also be tetrahedral. So we see here, in this particular molecule, all the oxygens are directed towards the corners of a tetrahedron and because all four are oxygen atoms and uh, their bond pole moments cancel each other and so the net dipole moment of this particular molecule is zero. So now coming to SF4, SF4 again, here we see the bond pairs are four in number and there is one lone pair. So together this molecular uh, geometry is of the parent geometry is of the type AX5. So if it is of AX5, the parent geometry is trigonal bipyramidal. Uh, but the shape of the molecule, because here it is having one lone pair of electron, it means one AEX4, that is one pair of electron and X4. So such a molecule, we know the um, lone pair occupies the equatorial position and so it has a seesaw shape and similarly when we talk about IF4 here also it is quite similar as that of SF4 and because it is the same as that of SF4 uh, the geometry is uh, trigonal pi pyramidal and the shape will be seesaw shape so IF4 plus is a seesaw geometry and uh, when we talk about hybridization, I, I earlier said we talked about valence bond theory. So there is a direct connect between BACPR theory and valence bond theory. So we know if the geometry is tetrahedral, the hybridization will be sp3. Here also the hybridization is sp3. And here the hybridization will be sp3d because there are uh, four bonds. Um, and here also the hybridization will be sp3d. So because uh, we are having, uh, sorry, five bonds, there are five bonds. So the hybridization will be sp3. So uh, this is how we have a direct connect between 
BACPR theory and valence bond theory and the geometry and shape of the molecules. So, therefore, we see in this particular set of molecules only two of them are having a C saw shape whereas the other two are tetrahedral. So, the answer to this particular question is option 1 which is 2. So, the only two molecules that have this geometry is SF4 and IF4+. Thank you. Please like and subscribe our videos and share with your friends.